guys welcome back to my channel today I'm going to do a bargain shopping haul just a bunch of stuff that I got for so 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 cheap this video is just on what I purchased for my kids um, I'm gonna do all my stuff on a separate video that way if you're not interested in one or the other I could have just did a timestamp but I figured I'll just make so, um, I have a situation going on on my face I've been trying a whole lot of um, different skincare products and makeup and apparently my skin fucking hates me right now so I am not putting on any makeup for the next week or two until this kind of clears up I'm also filming in front of my front door because I'd, I'd just I'd rather film with natural light instead of artificial lights because it's so hot and I just uh, I say it's hot and then I have a long sleeve shirt on in like 80 degree weather anyway um, if you didn't see yesterday's video I will link it down below it's a mall haul and in that video I have a Victoria's Secret giveaway so if you haven't checked it out click the link in the description box and make sure you enter the giveaway Okay, so since I'm filming in front of the door, you may hear the wind blowing. It's like been storming and everything, but it's nice and sunshiny. So if you hear the wind blowing or a car driving by, I apologize. And if my face offends you, I'm sorry. There's nothing I can do about it, and I don't want to pile a load of, a load of makeup on my skin. Okay, enough rambling. Let's get into the haul. The first place I went to was Family Dollar, and I did mention this in a vlog. I picked up two pairs of shoes for Sophie. So the first ones are these silver, sparkly, just like your slip-on canvas style shoes. And these were only $7. So they're actually way too big for her right now. I got them in a size 11. She wears a 10, so I figured they'd just be a tiny bit big. But no, they're a lot big. So I'll save these for a later time, but these are excuse me these are the first pair of shoes that I got for Sophia then I got her these really cute boots and they're sparkly sequins with the buckle and they look like this and they do have a zipper on the inside of the boot and I think I only paid like ten dollars for these they were so so cheap and again these came from this family is a bit random dollar. but I went to Cracker Barrel the other day and they had a 50 and 70 percent off rack and I got Sophie these rain boots because here in Florida we get lots and lots of rain and I bought these little Olaf rain boots and they look like that and then on the inside they also have a picture and these are also a little bit too big but what size did I get these in I got them in a size 11 12 but they are really really big her foot is only about this big so She's got a ways to go before she can wear them. She could wear them. They're just going to be a little heavy and a little floppy. But yeah, so that is what I got for Sophie from Cracker Barrel. Oh, and I only paid about $10 for these boots. Okay, then I went to the flea market today and I picked up this pillow. Um, she goes to school full time, but they do have a nap from 12 to 2 o'clock and her teacher requested that if you know the students want to bring pillows for nap time they can so I picked up this Sophia the first print and it's so cute it has the ruffle detail and what I like most about this pillow is it has a removable cover so every Friday um, they send their blankets and stuff home so I'll be able to take the cover off and wash it and have it ready to go for the following week. So I paid six dollars for this. Who was Kids Foot Locker? And I know you're probably like, um, you said this was a bar bargain shopping haul, and it is. Uh, these shoes retail for a uh, hundred and ten dollars, and I only paid I think they were fifty nine or sixty nine dollars. And these are the Jordan Air Deluxe, and they're just black on black. So they look like this and they are really really nice and because they are all black I got these for Gary and you can see the Jordan um, logo here um, I bought these for him because they can go with pretty much anything I, I, actually they can go with anything and um, they just have a black sole they have that air whatever thing on the bottom and I just thought these were a great shoe especially you know because they're black they won't show 
all the nitty gritty and hopefully he'll take good care of these and keep them nice and clean. It's always a good investment to get good shoes for your kids. Yeah. These were a great pair of shoes that I found for him and he really, really likes them. Next stop is, well, let me turn it around. Once Upon a Child. And some of these items actually came from Play-Doh's Closet, but um, they had where if you go green and leave the store without a bag, you got an extra stamp on your rewards card. So um, most of the stuff that you see for the boys actually came from Play-Doh's Closet, but everything that I'm showing in this little group here um, came from Play-Doh's Closet. So the first thing I got, um, these are for the boys, are these Nike gym shorts, and they're just red and they look like this do they have a check on them yeah they have a little nike check right here on the bottom and i only paid ten dollars for these i did get them in a size large and these are men's sizes by the way because plato's closet doesn't sell children's clothes but i got them in a size large and they don't really look to be that big so and you know they like their basketball shorts kind of baggy anyway so there's those are the first pair that i got then i got these gray adidas and they look like this and they have the adidas stripe on the sides and this was only eight dollars and this is also a men's large then i got a, another pair of basketball shorts and these are the dry fit nike these are mediums i paid twelve dollars for these and they just look like this so they're blue and they have some funky little pattern there with the nike check at the bottom then I just grabbed a couple of t-shirts while I was there. I was so hot and I had so much stuff in my hands. I could have gotten more, but I was tired of holding everything. So the first shirt I got is by the brand Diamond Supply. So it looks like this and it says Black Diamonds or Diamond Life and it has a bunch of black diamonds in dude's hand. And this was only $6 and this is a men's small. So it looks like that. Then I got another t-shirt and this is a men's large and I only paid $4 for this one and this is by the brand Tony Hawk and it looks like this. So it has some money in all funky little colors and it looks like that. Now the wind is really blowing so I apologize if you can hear it but I have to because I'm hot. Okay, now the rest of this stuff came from the children's place and I grabbed a few pair of shoes the first pair I got are by the brand Smart Fit, and they look like this. They're just a pink ballet flat type of shoe, and they have a Velcro strap and a little bow on the front. So hopefully these fit Sophie. I will have to disinfect them if they do fit. Um, then the next pair I got, and these look to be brand new. These are Nike sandals. They're like a foam kind. I got these in a size 9. These were $7.00. So they look like this and they just have velcro straps but they don't look to have any marks or stains on them at all so they look brand new i think they are brand new but yeah so that's that then i got another pair of smart fit ballet style flat type of shoes but these ones are glittery and they also have a little strap i got these in a size 10 and a half and these were only three dollars so yeah and they're in great shape so one more pair this. of shoes for sophie these look a little bit big but they're only a size 10. these are not brand new but they're in great shape and they're by the brand old navy and they're just like those foamy type of sandals and i figured here in the summertime here in florida you know they're breathable they're cushioned they're you know they'll be comfortable for her to run around and play in and her feet won't get so hot so yeah and i paid four dollars for these Okay, the rest of this stuff is clothes and all of this stuff came from the children's place so the first thing i grabbed are these quick dry basketball shorts by the brand layer and they're in a size 14 they're brand new as you can see they have the tag here brand new from the store and i only paid two dollars for these so they're like an aqua and gray color and yeah my boys love basketball shorts that's all they ever want to wear anymore so Anytime I see a pair that I think will fit them, as long as it's a reasonable price, I'll get it. Okay, now for Sophie, I got this t-shirt. It was a mistake filming in front of the door. I don't know. I'll see when I edit the video. But anyway, it's by the brand 365 Kids, and I paid $2 for this t-shirt. 
has a nice pretty unicorn with some really like lacy ruffles on the front and that is that I got her another t-shirt this is by the brand children's place this was three dollars it's a high-low shirt and it has a really cute heart face on the front with some long lashes I don't get the mustache and the lashes thing I don't know okay the next thing is actually a two-piece set so it comes with please tell me it's a skirt yeah it's a really like Tiffany blue ruffly skirt um skirt actually it has shorts underneath so that is the bottoms and this was brand new you see it still has the tag and I only paid seven dollars for the set and it's by the brand J khaki so yeah as you can see it's brand new seven dollars for the set and it has a really cute um, teal green and purple octopus on white so this is so cute I love putting kids in like two piece sets I just think they're so adorable then I got her this plain gray and white striped shirt it's by the brand famous and I paid two dollars for this t-shirt and it is not high low so it is v-neck and I just I love basics and stuff like that so yeah Okay, this is by the brand Girls Love Pink. I paid $1.50 for this shirt. It's like a button-up style. Um, she will have to wear a cami underneath because it is see-through. But the sleeves are so cute. They have this white lace. And it is slightly high-low. does have a collar, so I thought that was adorable. Then this t-shirt is by the brand Maggie and Zoe. I paid $2 for the tank top and it's white with these really pretty pink flowers. And then the back has this really cute cutout and a long bow thingy on the back side of it. It is very, very slightly high-low as you can see, but it's so, so cute. Okay, this t-shirt is also by the Children's Place. I paid $3 for this t-shirt and it has a little... French Bulldog on it and it says I woof you so cute right okay next are some jean shorts by Jimboree I paid six dollars for these but Jimboree is a quite pricey brand for children so they look like this and she goes to a private school so I try to purchase um, shorts that are just a tad bit longer than normal if not a lot longer than a normal pair of shorts just because you know being in a private school they have a lot of rules and regulations on the dress code so these were six dollars and they look like this these are by the brand almost famous and these were three dollars and these are so cute they have these rhinestones all over the front and just a tiny bit on the back and I love the faded wash of these shorts okay these are by Gap Kids I paid six dollars for these and again they're just a little bit longer almost a capri length but not so much they're like a board short I would say like a board short so yeah so cute and again I love the light faded wash of the jeans okay these are by the brand Vanilla Star I paid three dollars for these ones and they look like this they have a really cute um, embroidered flower and like cross uh, I don't know what you call it but they look like that and they're really really cute and they have a small slit on the side not quite sure if she'll be able to wear these to school I'll have to try them on her and see how short they are because as you can see they're a lot shorter than the last pair that I showed okay these are by Arizona and these were actually brand new so they have bow pockets on the front the plain pockets on the back and these originally were $24 and I paid $6 for these ones okay these are LEI and I paid $4 for these and they're just a purple jean short and they are cuffed at the bottom and just plain on the back very cute okay this is by the brand okie dokie this was three dollars and it's just a white ribbed t-shirt with some little kitties and the pink kitty has a crown as you can see so cute she's gonna love this t-shirt 
Okay, this one I thought was really fun. This is by the brand Crazy 8, which is like a sister company to the Gymboree. And I paid $3 for this shirt, and it says bring on the sun so so cute very bright perfect for spring and summer here in florida and i thought it was just adorable okay here's another pair of jean shorts these are also like the pink pair that i showed by the brand arizona except for these are just the regular denim wash and again they have the bows on the pockets and then plain pockets on the back and i paid five dollars for these ones so six dollars for the brand new ones Five for those okay these are by crazy eights and I paid four dollars for these plaid shorts here and they're pink blue white and green okay this is by Jimboree I paid three dollars for this and it's just a white t-shirt with a really cute purple bunny and the bunny has a bow and it is all sequins so very very cute very she's just gonna look hold on Next t-shirt is by the brand Old Navy. I paid $2 for this one. And it's really cute. It's a white t-shirt with hot pink stripes. And then it has gold and silver polka dots. So it looks like that. And the sleeves are um, cuffed on this one. Okay, these shorts are by the brand Oshkosh. And these were $4. So they have uh, a really cute flower print. have this really like it's like a string or whatever almost like a shoelace but a little bit bigger and then the pockets have the flaps on the outside and I don't know if I mentioned this was four dollars by Oshkosh and then the last item I got and this will be it for this haul I do believe um, this is by the brand mud and I paid two dollars for this one and it's really cute. It's almost like a denim shirt with white polka dots. And it has some ruffles on the bottom. Well, it's a tank top, not a t-shirt. But I just thought it was so cute. And to wear with, like, you know, a pair of those Everything shorts. In the haul that I um, have for my children. So I hope you all enjoyed this video. Please thumbs it up if you enjoy these type of hauls. I did do a few of them, or I have done a few of them in the past. I will link those down below for you to check out. Don't forget to subscribe if you're new, if this is your first time clicking on one of my videos. Thank you so much for tuning in. I hope you stick around and come back for more. And yeah, thank you all so much for watching. I'll see you in the next video. Bye, guys.